Hey everyone, you clicked this video because you were looking for a way to stop smoking without medication. And I admit that I have always thought that medication might be the statistically best way to make that happen. I actually started hanging out in the Stop Smoking subreddit and met a lot of people there who had used a book that I honestly had never even heard of during med school um, for, that helped them stop smoking. And so I'm gonna talk about that today as another potential tool in the toolbox that might help you get by. Uh, maybe you've tried medicines before and they haven't worked. Maybe you'd like to make an attempt, a quits attempt without medications and you wanna try something. Maybe you wanna try with medications that are looking for a little extra something to help you get over the top. I don't particularly care how you stop smoking. I just want you to be able to. So today we're gonna to talk about a book that I bought. This is called Alan Carr's Easy Way to Stop Smoking. Uh, they sell books. They also do uh, in-person seminars. I'm gonna put some studies linked below. They're gonna talk about some of the success rates claimed in studies on some of their six hour seminars that they do. And I think that this is a potential worthwhile, worthwhile thing to look into for you because there are a lot of people who claim that this book has really helped them get through it by changing their mindset and in their mind, eliminating the need to deal with medications, eliminating some of the craving for cigarettes that they had and helping them reprocess the addiction that they've been dealing with in a different light. And to me, as I've just read through this book, it's a pretty quick read. I read through it in one day. Um, as as the way to look through this, I kind of feel like the, the main point is it helped change the point from like, hey, here's all the bad things about cigarettes and here's the things that will help me. Um, I need to build up this, this con list to um, contrast with the pro list. And it seems like this book does a pretty decent job of helping attack the existence of a pro list and saying that, are there really any benefits to smoking? And really the answer is there are not benefits to smoking for the most part. So I think that it's a really interesting approach to the idea of quitting smoking. And I think that it's something that might work for you. If you'd like to try this book, go ahead and buy it. I'll put a link below. It's an, it's an affiliate link if it's something you're interested in. I'll also put links to where you can buy uh, nicotine replacement therapy stuff. You can buy nicotine patches online without having a prescription. Uh, I'll also put down some lists for some pharmacology studies if you wanna nerd out on that a little bit. Some of the medicines that are FDA approved for quitting smoking, including Welbutrin and um, Varenicline, those, um, those require prescriptions. So you'll have to talk to your physician about those. But if you wanna make an attempt without medications, uh, there's a chance that this book might actually help you out. Might be worth a shot. Um, frankly, anything would be worth an attempt if it might help you lower your odds of smoking again. I do believe you can quit. If you're looking for some good support, please check out the Stop Smoking subreddit. I actually think that they've been a very supportive community. They do a lot of good things. They're helping each other out. And a lot of folks are there to celebrate with you and to walk you through the frustration of this process of quitting smoking. I think you can do it.